Hey, so, hi, my name is James. If anyone doesn't know me, I'm a fr freshman this year. And this semester, I took over co-staff for um, Chief of Staff. So I just want to be just quick and direct, seeing that we have a busy schedule today. So I, to start off, I know how the system, how PA works, seeing that I've been to some of the exact cabinet meetings. I've seen how, I see how, like, how we have to pass stuff, and I see what the problems that <coughs> lie in PA right now um, for my position. So I, I specifically know how to, like, I, and I've been working on the problems so I'm just gonna I'm just saying right now. For next semester, I want to just say, um, as chief of staff, I know how to fix. I know I know solutions to the problems that that my positions entails, and I want to fix them now. The um, problems such as the storage that we've been trying to find for our um, sto um, for our, uh, oh inventory. Okay, I didn't think it'd be that fast, but okay. <laughs> Well, I'm just gonna say, I'm just gonna say, um, as chief of staff, I know what the problems entail, and I know how to, I know, how, I know the solutions to them. So, yeah. Uh, Any questions? Yeah. Anything? Panel members, any questions? Hold on, let me think about this. Sorry. Okay. Yeah, just. What are your plans for storage of inventory? Well, we've talked to a couple of the, we talked to a couple of people around. Um, we looked at some storage units around Merced and saw um, their prices, and we talked about like what, how much it would in, impact um, the prices, how much it would impact the the membership <coughs> fees. But we don't know exactly what the price is, seeing that we don't know how many people are. Be, um, we don't know how much are how many members could actually come in. So we we had an idea of like proposing it this semester, but we kind of held off into it to, um, for our next cabinet meeting. But um, for now, we've actually had people step up and hold on to storage, like some of the storages at, um, at Carl's house, some of the storages at Ray's house. So we found people that are willing to take in some of the storage units, so that's why I'm grateful. So uh, one, of our, one of the ways we can would address this problem next semester is either um, finding a permanent place for the storage next next for next semester for future generations, or find a house that's willing to take all the storage in and just like keep it there. Because like what we've been like, it's from what I've been hearing, it's just been jumping from house to house, and it's kind of a burden. It's just been a burden to other people. Okay, so as opposed to the one minute, we're gonna go and take three questions total. Okay, so we have two more questions for James. Yes. Uh, what are your plans to preserve the history of our life? Um, well, what we've been talking during the meeting is to um, first try to preserve like, like all of our all of our data that we've been going through throughout PA, like like memory data. So we were trying to find like an internal hard drive to store all of our information. Is <coughs> like what kind? What do you mean history? Like. Like um, cultural history, or is it like our and our like uh, yeah, like like things that we've done, like kind of like pictures. From oh, okay, so like, we've actually tried to fix this problem. So we were looking into um, a external hard drive, which is about one terabyte, and we found this to be more cost efficient due to um, than using a cloud, seeing that we'd have to pay monthly for that, compared to one terabyte of information, which does, that's a lot, and it would be portable between each of the. Um, members, um, cabinet members in PA, so we would, and, for, and it would be up to chief of staff to keep track of that terabyte of information and just monitor it and see how much space has been used and, keep, and mainly just keep track of it and store it and store all of our information. Uh, any question? Any other One questions? <coughs> I got one. Um, so what are your dreams for the club? Um, my dreams for the club is just not only to like keep it as it is, but improve upon it. Seeing like this semester, this semester, it's like it's giving me a good impression of what college is, and that's what I want to keep it going for other future freshmen and keep that tradition of PA of like just being this really nice cultural club that really embraces the culture, but also gives back to its school and just keep that keep that going. Sounds good. All right, so thank you. That was James.